Hello everyone. This video will show you how to place TENS pads while doing biofeedback using Generator X. It is better to have the electrodes as close as possible across the problem area so that the signal can pass more bad pathogen cells and bisect the area of interest. If it is the liver, place the pads at the front and back of the liver. If it is the kidneys, you could place the pads either across one front and back or across both side to side. And this is for the abdomen, calf pain, shin pain, lower back, sciatica, upper back, elbow, hip and glutes, knee, rear thigh, quad, shoulder. For a general scan, place the pads on the left and right side of the torso, midway between the hips and the shoulders. The signal will go through the gut, which is a major organ, reflecting the state of your body. Many pathogens reside there. For head and neck areas, do not place the TENS pads directly because your two most important organs reside there, the thyroid and your brain. Use the back of both shoulders. It is not a good idea to place TENS pads at the right wrist and left ankle for a scan using Generator X. The results will not be as precise as if the TENS pads are close. There are two reasons. A. The signal strengths are passing through many healthy tissues, overshadowing the signal of the pathogens. B. The strength of the signals is reduced because the human body has resistance to electrical signals. TENS pads placement warning. The safety of our users is our top priority. Please do not use TENS pads above the neckline or across the heart. Serious injury can occur if TENS pads are not being used as suggested. If people wish to experiment with placement outside our guidelines, we cannot be held responsible for any adverse effects. Thank you for watching this video.